How to set up sleep sensing on the second generation Nest Hub from Google. Sleep sensing on the second generation Nest Hub helps you get a better understanding of your sleep. It uses motion and sound to monitor your sleep. There's nothing to wear or remember to charge. To set up sleep sensing, open the Google Home app and select your Nest Hub. Tap Settings, then Sleep Sensing. You'll see a welcome screen letting you know that you'll be able to enjoy sleep sensing features until next year. Tap Next to start the setup process. You'll see an overview of sleep sensing. Tap Next to learn more about how it works. Sleep sensing lets you connect devices like your Nest Hub and Google Fit to help you track your sleep. Tap Agree to activate sleep sensing. Next, you can set up sound events tracking. Tap Next to learn more. This feature can help you get a better understanding of what might be disturbing your rest, like coughing or snoring. Tap Agree to activate sound events tracking. Next, you can set up personalized sleep suggestions. Tap Next to learn more about how it works. Personalized sleep suggestions can give you insights and suggestions from Google Fit based on your sleep-related data. Tap Agree to activate personalized sleep suggestions. Next, you can enable some more features using the Google Fit app to get more detailed insights. Tap Next to continue. Now set up your sleep schedule. This will help your Nest Hub get a better understanding of your sleep habits, like when you go to bed, so you can get insights and suggestions for better sleep. Now, let's set up your Nest Hub. Swipe up from the bottom of the screen and tap Settings. Tap Sleep Sensing. Now, tap Calibrate. Then, tap Continue to begin the calibration process. Next, place your Nest Hub on a bedside table. Make sure it's level with the top of your mattress. It should be about one to two feet from your bed or within arm's length. Then angle the display towards your torso, facing your chest, so the motion sensors can track your breathing while you sleep. Remember to avoid placing anything in front of the display, like a water bottle or other large objects. This will help make sure your sleep summary data is accurate. Small items, like a phone, at the base of the display are okay. Now lie in the spot where you usually sleep. Make sure you're alone in bed with no other people or pets nearby. Tap Start and follow the voice instructions to finish the calibration process. Once your Nest Hub is calibrated, the sleep sensing icon will appear on your screen. You'll only see the sleep sensing icon when someone is near the bed, indicating that sleep sensing is ready to track your sleep. And remember, you can turn sleep sensing on or off on your display or deactivate it in the Google Home app at any time. To turn it on or off, Go to the Settings menu on your Nest Hub. Tap Sleep Sensing. Then, tap to turn it on or off. To deactivate Sleep Sensing, open the Google Home app and select your Nest Hub. Tap Settings. Then, Sleep Sensing. And select Deactivate Sleep Sensing. Click the checkbox to turn off access to your sleep data. Your Nest Hub will no longer track your sleep. You'll need to set up your device again when you want to reactivate this feature. To finish up, tap Deactivate. To learn more, visit the Google Help Center.